Um, well, I do, pass on to, um, but I do want to get dogs used to being in there. So if we can pick two dogs that we can start with in that building, not, I mean, I'd love to put like Hyde and Venus, but they're just gonna, I feel like they're just loud. So two quiet dogs. Interesting. They're not loud like here. the Edgar, yeah. the Bello, the Charlotte. In that age group, there's medium dogs. So, yeah. On the back side, they're Harper and them. Yeah. They're quiet well, on the Harper's down with you now, and she doesn't think. Oh, you're down. talking about the back side of the Your Bellow and Edgar down there. Yeah. Well, like Harper. Yeah. On the back side of Ice. Yeah. Because they're used to, I mean. Uh -huh. Right. It's just transitioning down yeah. a little bit. The only difference is them just being a different environment. Yeah. Hey, what'd you get there? <laughs> I said to her yesterday, hello, roommate. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the new part-time resident. Yeah. <laughs> and also, uh, at some point I'll talk to you because I want to try to get um, big food to some Can you imagine going to a lot Who can we get to take him out? Um, I'm going to... What about uh, Shirley? He's intact, too. Yeah. I'll email Shirley. Donna Kimball is going to take him, but she's going away. Don Floor. I'm Today. Who was it that just moved other Connecticut? They want a deaf dog from us. Mm -hmm. They know Stacy and Merle. I wonder if they, how long is he going to be here? Just three days. Oh, so and I don't want to borrow and see if they really want a deaf dog. I don't understand what's happening with that. But yeah. I'll, I'm going to email Donna. Before. Yeah, let's figure out a plan for that. That's not a good idea. How did the bugs do on their first trip to Kennel 10? Uh, they were passed out on the bed, so I think that's a good sign. Um, I flooded it with toys so they wouldn't pee on it. That's our big problem. They come off that top area and they walk to the second area and they pee. So I tried to cover it with as many toys as I could. Um, I didn't think it worked. I didn't see any pee. Tomorrow morning, um, Pam's going to feed them up here, walk them down, and then put them right in 10. That's why I didn't put anybody in there tonight. Sorry. Um, but I didn't also, it's hot, and I didn't feel like collecting all the toys that I put in there. <laughs> it's a little It's a little insane. Did anyone see it? I'll show you guys. But they're used to all that. That's great. Oh, Eric heard. It's weird. They'll each take a pillow. Yeah, no, so it worked out. It's not letting me do it. Whatever. Um they seemed to have fun, then they, they came out and ate on the hill, and then I walked them back up. So, did the other two poop? No, I haven't oh, collected any. I got six poops on my walk up, so. Two still are loaded. Um, How is Walter today? Walter's good. We've just decided that he likes his bandage changed in the morning because if I, I'm going to start doing it two day bandage changing on my own, and then the third day go to Danvers Animal Hospital. Um, so today, I was going to wait till, till I got home tonight to change his bandage because, I don't know, a little bit more space and easier place for me to lie him down in my house. My mom's going to help, and um, we didn't make it till today because at 10 o'clock, I got a message from someone on Facebook, thank you, just tell, telling me that he was chewing his leg, and Shannon was like two kennels down. So she pulled him out, and he just got into the skin. So... Um, I really appreciate that. Anybody watching, I noticed they've been keeping the cam on them, which is wonderful. Um, so, but feel free if there's dogs playing in the arena, I mean, you guys can spin it, but it's just, it's really, it's a good peace of mind. Um, otherwise, I'm calling Chan every hour. Is he okay? What's he doing? What's he doing? It's stressful, um, but it is a big open thing. It is gross. Um, I saw it, Megan. Yeah, thank you. You thank you. <laughs> I can't thank you enough for it. Um, so, because the other day we didn't get to it in time, and he actually punctured a small little hole next to the giant hole. So, yeah. <laughs> Let's just hope we don't have to do skin graphing. That doesn't seem like it would be fun. George was saying you have to cut a huge flap of skin. And pull it down and tack it. Are we I don't ready? Know what that means, but She's doing so you, yeah, we're ready for you. If you want to pop in here, just about yeah. Um, Carly hey. mentioned she wanted everyone to use pee pads for the pups, and Shannon mentioned put towels outside of Canada, but you shouldn't. They have pee pads out there. Excuse they are notorious. This group for shredding and eating pee pads. So down in the barn, it was just easier for us because um, they're not monitored outside to put a towel down. So they had towels outside in kennel ten. Um, 
and it was working. It was it, it was attracting them to go outside. So they've already um, been trained to pee on towels up here. Yeah, so I couldn't. Um, I could it be nice in an airport to put one down and have it pee? No, I'd rather it hold really? it till the appropriate time to pee. <laughs> <laughs> I can't move fast enough to go in there. Who was your star today? Uh, Jagger was really good today. He was really good. He's really skinny, but really good. Super, super lanky. Tail's about this long on him, so I think he's going to be a really big boy. Hopefully he'll take after his uncle with his size. How's your dog's leg? I did my first bandage change today. Oh, okay. In the ice house. That doesn't answer the question. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to get, I was trying to stretch. So we've been doing the bandage change every morning at like in between 7.30 and 8 o'clock. Yeah. So we, I went there yesterday at 8, 7.30. We changed the bandage and then... I got the supplies to do it myself, so what I really wanted was to hold off till tonight when I got home, change it at night or whatever. We didn't make it past 10 o'clock this morning. One of the camera people messaged me on Facebook and said he's chewing at his leg, and I got there just in time, or Shannon did, just in time. He'd just gotten to the spot on it. So I think what it is is with that wet-to-dry bandaging, I think that, that it's doing what it's supposed to do, and it's pulling at the skin because it's trying to pull, and it's irritating him, so he wants it off. It's itchy, maybe, so... I would also think it's smell, the serum. Yep. The serum that attracts them to lick, lick, yeah, lick, yeah, lick, yeah. Lick, so lick. he, um, he's da, 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 bite, 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 bite. So I pulled him into the. So my plan didn't work. So tomorrow morning, I'm gonna stick to the AM bandage change. I told them, and I'm gonna. Uh, my mom's gonna help me at my house. She has a little area set up for us to do bandage changing. So. <laughs> Did your dog rule your household? No. 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 Never. <laughs> um, so. I sent my daily, I sent my photo along to George. The part on the top of the, we were watching, I keep, because I keep taking the camera at an angle like this. So at 12 o'clock, it would be three o'clock if he was standing. Yeah. There was, at the, when we first took the bandage off, that's way last Friday, it was, that was black. Um, and then it turned to green. And now it turned to white, whitish yellow. Ooh, so, and now it's like just barely hanging on. So when George says when I take the bandage off, because I'm gloved and everything, to try and like tug on it a little bit, but you don't, you don't like that. You know. <laughs> yeah, I went originally when I was like trying to get myself organized to change the bandage in the ice house. I went in the barn. I'm like, I need gloves. Like George, you know George doesn't even use gloves. I mean, but I'm like, I need gloves. Like so, I'm like looking around. I grab a box. I I pulled out. There's like bird feathers and everything. And I was like, these are not sterile gloves. <laughs> so I went in and I found an unopened box that I opened and used. We have several of them. Yeah, too. yeah. There was. I took them out. There's like ten boxes in the ice house. So uh, I did that. So tomorrow morning I will change his bandage. Uh, George was pleased with the photo I sent him today. He said that it looks good. My bandage is nearly not as good. As, I mean, they their vet, I was talking to Fiona, I was watching her. She has this technique for, you know, the vet wrap, you start and like yeah. you make you work your way down, but it's like to cover the foot. So like I watched her like bring it back and forth, back and forth and hold it and then wrap it on the sides and cut. Like she did this fancy and I was like, wow, I, I don't even know how you choose like six years of vet school. This is what I learned. <laughs> it's like, that's amazing. So mine has like two different colors because I couldn't get the, Whatever. And it's very lumpy, but it's fine. So it's on. It's all that matters. Um, all right. That's about, oh, there's uh, a question for Pam. How's Chester's limping? Chester's just, he's Chester. good. He's just limping a little. Yeah. He, he was, he and the other two were running like maniacs mm. in, my, in my yard. The, the earth was shaking. Yeah. And then he came in. Yeah. <laughs> so we're just just yeah. tender. Yeah, that's my dogs yeah. all the time. Always. All right. Well, you guys are on, so stay t I'm sure I'll have some fun, exciting story after tomorrow morning for my bandage change at home with my mother. So I'll keep you guys posted. Okay. I know. It's just that's what I was thinking. That they, it's just like, you know, they double it back and then like hold it where they want it. I don't know. I can't even. I gotta get it. Okay. Sting is still with Pauline. I don't know if that's oh, okay. written up here. No. Um, How did you make the seat go away? You pulled up on something. 
the, the, ah, the back. Oh dear, it went down. That was the wrong thing. Now it looks like the Hobbit chair I've been sitting in. <laughs> no, the, there was like some. Wasn't this? Didn't we do something with this? Yeah. Like this. Oh, you, are you talking about the bubble in the back? It's this bubble. Lean back on it. Does that do anything? Oh! No. <laughs> no. 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 I don't know. Well, well, but that must do something, right? That does something. I don't know if it pumps air. Like, see how it's like almost like a pump? Is it? Do, do you feel me? <laughs> no. <laughs> One day we'll figure. <laughs> no. Okay. That's enough fascination for Mel Ball. Okay. Board. Let me throw that one out. Here we have Bernard Shepard, Hanscom Air Force Base. Oh, I know who this is. I think she was in. There we go. This is from Melrose Mass. Melrose Mass. <laughs> Relax. Just another, just another, oh, it's a birthday. Isn't that cute? Mm -hmm. Carol. Thank you very much, Carol. That's a cute picture. Mm -hmm. Everybody look at the picture. Oh, that's how I feel some days. <laughs> right. <laughs> it's like that. Triple A. That goes over there. And then this one oh, it's got a lot of is on. from, yeah. oh. Oh, no, this is one we said to somebody that didn't go. Cal calendar, I guess. Something like that. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We sent it to Ontario. No, someplace. Saliba. Victoria Saliba. If you haven't got whatever you ordered, that's why. Good Lord, it's $15 posted. But they didn't take it. Huh. That's a calendar. It says so right here. Okay, so we have to find out her address and try it again. Yeah. Oh, that's right. We do buy. I, wouldn't you think? I would know. Carol, Banner Springs, Kansas. Fan this. Pepper, it's for the doggies. <laughs> Save from Sonic. Hope they enjoy, and a card for me, okay? Look at that, that's a good one. Oh, it's your birthday. Do whatever makes me, whatever makes your ass happy. <laughs> no. Saw this and always oh, thought, thought right away of you. Love what you do for yeah. everyone. Happy birthday and many happy returns. Carol. Almost a Dane, CP. There you go. Thank you. Peppermints for the dog food. Oh, boys. Okay. We have to put them in something special. Yeah. See, this is the kind of paper that those puppies need. I keep telling you guys. I put it down yet, but I put it down. I'll tear it up. Make a mess. That's good. That's all right. It's Oh, these are smaller. I see. Wasn't that cute? Isn't that cute? We have some puppy pickers. Who are those puppy pickers? They're somebody else. Okay. And Cooper. Texas. Very nice. Thank you. Put that in the puppy department. And that is it. That's it? Awesome. That's it. That's it. Okay. All right. So that means... I'll work. take this and go away. Back to the front floor. This is. I don't know, work at it. 
Here we go. I'm getting there. Oh. All right. Let's do questions. What happened? That's crazy. That check, I had to write another check to that Eric videographer. Correct. It came back again. Betsy, Betsy, Betsy's not too good at that stuff. Okay. So I've told her to come pick it up here, but now he thinks I haven't paid him. <laughs> or is this the it. first one? That's the second one. You return. You got the second one. You got the first one back. Oh, here? I assume that's the second. No, one. No, I think that's the first one. Oh. Yeah, I think that was the first oh, return. Okay. They told maybe, us. Maybe that's right. I believe so. It took a long time to turn it. Turn it. I think so because I don't. I don't think we. I don't think we got one yet. So we're not going to do anything until we're We're just going to leave it there until Betsy comes along. Correct. I could open it and see what number it is. That would work. Yeah. Okay, how was your day today? Did you do any training? I, I have begun to play with Fizzle again a little bit. I took her out for a run with no leash. Is the quilted purple stool new? Yes, it is. It's very nice. It must be hot there, you're damn right. It is very hot. Yeah, it's very humid. Trainer talk. Do you know what brand the chair is? We can look the manual up online. No. Harry Cole update. He's feeling a little better today. Willing, willingly ate two spoons of wet dog food on his own. Wow. That's progress. Yeah. They don't want to eat. There's not a lot you can do about it. I know. That really is the, the tell, isn't it? Yeah. How is Pam? When do you go home? I'm great. Oh. I go home sometime tomorrow. <laughs> I'm not sure exactly when. I have to do the overnight tonight. We're short on overnighters this week, so... I'm here another overnight um, training somebody new that you met on Sunday. Her name is Brittany from Endicott College. So it's, okay. it works out fine that I'm here because then, you know, she's helping and then also I can help her. So all is well. So I'm either going to leave crack of dawn or the first chance I get around 10 or 11. It doesn't pay to go down there at rush hour time. Not at all. I can, I, my windows of opportunity are very slim. How did the matted pictures sell at Dogfest? I haven't a clue. We didn't keep track, but you can see how many you have. I don't remember exactly what you had. I, I think you sold a few, but not. I sold one woman take seven. Yeah, but you made a lot. I mean, oh, I made an awful lot. But they will at at you know let us get going regrouped. Mm -hmm. And we will put the matted photos and the cards and the quilts online on the doggy bag. Yeah. And the, and the quilts, we thought we would say, if you have a color preference, because we can't take pictures of every single quilt. Yeah. So if you have a color preference or a scheme you like, you can put it in notes, but there's no guarantee. But we would always do our best to find you one, because there are colors Clearly, that you can no. pick. Um, but I wanted to wait bef until everybody's ready to take orders. And we love Tom Terrific. Tom does well. The 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 puppies love him. Gabby likes him. Yeah, very uh, cool update from. Is there an update there? From that me? was the one with him eating the spoon. Oh, is full that of all there is? That's the whole update. That's that. Yeah. Um. What is the other stool covered with? It looks like purple flannel. It's a the fluffy. Somebody that's a, else, that's a fluffy. Coat. Jerry put a fluffy on the taped up one. So we have two purple stools now. How is Audrey doing? Getting bigger with every breath she takes. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> She's fine. How much for the quilts? I believe the quilts are 25 and I'm not sure exactly about the shipping aspect of it. I didn't realize it took them that long to make them. They made oh, 90, yeah. didn't they make like 90? six hours a quilt. 95 yeah. quilts 
And we sold, I think we sold 52 yeah. quilts. We have the tallies on the quilts. And if you sold 50, 25 bucks each, it's a lot of money. Yeah, there was like 1,100, I don't even know. The, you you saw that, the note she sent, right? No. I Oh, well, I'll forward it to you. Maybe she told you. <laughs> But it had the I total. I remember Linda going by saying, I got an awful lot of money in my bra. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and there's, yeah, a yeah. Lot of, there's a pile of money in my drawer. And it, it was not labeled, so I just left it there because I didn't put it there. So I figured it's got to come out of her bra. I don't really know. I don't know. All I know is I took every penny that was in the vendor box, put it in an envelope, and wrote vending on it. So Linda can figure that out. Um excited to see the cards for sale. You're, you're welcome. Tina reminded me about the cards, but we have every intention of getting it all on there. We just need to. You know, Linda does the shipping and the, and the orders, so, and she's, she has a couple days off, so, I mean, there's no sense in us having all these orders coming in so that she's overwhelmed, so we'll get caught up for a few days, and I'll get it on there. Is this Sunday Shatting Sunday? Yes, it's the first Sunday of the month. Auntie, Nanny, Pam, I know Mommy Jerry is hyper excited, but are you ready for Audrey's whelping? Got the phone hand signal down pat now. Yes, I do. I am ready. But I, you know, I, I will always come if I, you know, but if I'm home and there's lots of people, then there's... She does live somewhere else. Yeah, there's not... There's not, I mean, I try to weigh it out, you know, if it's... I really think she ought to rent that place out and live here. Yeah, well... It's a lot easier. Yeah. Um, let's see. But we have, we'll get the, we'll get the uh, call list up when Audrey moves in this weekend. So... The what stuff? Call list for Audrey's oh, call list. Call list, yeah. I see, okay. Uh, how is awesome Annie? Does she have any fractures? Hope and pray she feels better. She has a bunch of fractures. I've forgotten exactly what. Um, I put I put Steve's whole thing in the day. I know. The audience, <laughs> yeah, I, you did. <laughs> I, didn't, I, I did not put the whole thing in. But oh, I okay. I didn't it. even. Well, I Broke think. a bunch of stuff. Yeah, and she's going to call and try to call on Saturday, right? I think that was part of that email. During mail call. I don't know. They were going to go over and have dinner with her Friday night. And okay. Call during mail call. Oh, that's right. That's right. Because Saturday he'd be here. Right. Friday. Yeah. Are the how are the baby guinea hens? Not good. I think they've passed. Have they? I don't know. I never. I never saw them. No. I. I don't think. I think that it was. It was so hot out. I mean, no, it was. I, who knows? Yeah. Who knows? Um. Yeah, I don't think we have guinea hen management down pat. Because <laughs> no. I hear the babies were just kind of tumbling out of the nest. They were tumbling and then out. They, and then they travel all over the place. They were found all over the farm. Yeah. The one was found in the coop. Yeah, well, so, you know. I mean, in... The coop. The coop. <laughs> yeah. What is Mommy Jerry's puppy prediction? She's only allowed to have six. She's only allowed to have six. <laughs> we'll see how that works. Tina's giving a brick update. We're at uh, 61 percent. It's coming. <laughs> That's going to be a tough haul to get that first done. Oh, I know you were joking about Finn the night, and Finn had his birthday, so he just turned uh, whatever. What is it? Two now? Yeah. They had a party for him. Yeah. Just actually, they all. They had a party, and Seagram had had something going on, and who else? There were Kringle, Kringle, <laughs> and all that whole bunch had ice cream and cake and hats, and they had Asher. more birthday stuff than I've had in my yeah. whole life, I think. Asher, Asher, Asher. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I just adore Finn. I, I'm so happy I was able to name a dog. Um, I'm very confused about the package from me. Oh, I yeah. sent the mints through a company and they got there very fast, but uh, fast. But I could not have sent them a card to enclose in the box. Plus, I don't know when your birthday is, but didn't think it was now, and I don't know how it got there. I do remember the half-fast comment and the message sounded like me, so confused and old. 
I'm confused too now, but <laughs> we have mints in a card. Thank you. <laughs> um, regarding puppy predictions, we vote seven puppies because it's our lucky number. Okay. There you go. That's Seagram. Seagram and Amy. Okay. Anything? Let me see if I... And Carlene had a big bowl of ice cream, so she wasn't super hungry for dinner, but we are going to finish off, if we do have dinner, the ribs, because that is the only thing that we have left in the refrigerator from Dogfest Weekend. I bet you have some sweet potato, mashed sweet potatoes? Yes. I could eat a little bit of that, just a little glob of that, and not the rib. I had the rib for lunch, you know. I mean, I stuck one of those things oh, in a roll. Oh, there's a piece of chicken, too. That was what I had. Oh, a okay. A piece of chicken in a roll before I ate all that ice cream. <laughs> okay. But I'm a little bit short on the vegetable part, so I could have just a, a quarter of a cup of... Oh, and you know what else is in there? What? Pumpkin whoopie pie. What? A pumpkin whoopie pie. Really? Yes. I don't think I need more sweets. No, but... <laughs> But, I'll remember it. But have it before because it's, they said it was really good and it's okay. pumpkin whoopie pie. But there wasn't anything in there in the middle of the night for me. No, no little juggy things. No, because all we had was the lobster. And I tossed all that. No. And then I'm, the I'm pretty regular getting up at 1 o'clock. I didn't know Steve was up. We should have dinner together. Yeah. Well, I don't know what you're going to get at 1 o'clock tonight. We'll have to figure that out. Well, I can always use one of those. Noodles. Oh, the cup of noodles. Yeah. Cup of noodles. Did you I eat peanut butter. Did you eat the other last case or did they get eaten by others? Cuz we're them. on the second case. I, I, that's in the freezer, maybe? The, no, the cup of noodles? No. <laughs> no, the cake. What are we talking about here? Oh, you said you could have cup of noodles. Yeah. I and I was saying we this is the second case. Did you have a oh, case? case. Case? Did you have a case of cup of noodles yet, or is someone else helping you? I have, I have three or four on top of my freezer. I, yeah, I put those there because yeah. I wasn't sure if people were taking it, and I didn't want you looking for a cup of noodles and then not have one. No, that's one. okay. Put so. them up there. And the other thing I've, I've, I've eaten my way through are the peanut butter crackers. Yeah, I don't know that we have any more. I'll look through there. get some more of those. Those were good. Yeah, I'll put, I can put those. They got them at Costco, right? I think so. Yeah. yeah. Me Chipper Steve said that the rehab place where Annie is staying is very near his home, and he has had family who has stayed there, so he knows the staff and they know him, and he can pop in and visit. That made me feel better, so I thought I'd pass it along. He and he and uh, Deb are real good about checking in on uh, on Annie. Am I going to have a night night bedtime story for the bugs? I really and I really don't tell them stories. I I sing to them. So <laughs> if I have if there's something that's why I do keep the radio on low and I sing to them and they um, when they were first little I used to sing, We give hugs to bugs on rugs. Oh, we give hugs to bugs on rugs. And they loved that. They'd all come over for hugs. And uh, now we've graduated, so we get stop biting, stop chewing, don't jump. <laughs> Manners, you're rude. You're yeah, losing um, interest in the paper because it's lost its crackle. Yes. Yeah. All right. The October 2015. Oh. There are several rounds of puppy birthdays in the next... Yes, yes. the October. I know. It's, it, in some respects, it seems like yesterday, and in some respects, it seems like a lifetime ago. Um, okay, anybody else? Uh, buy a brick for me. My birthday is the 29th. Who said that? Lila May, October. Uh, I was outside a lot today. So I, I've had my fill of fresh air, and I think maybe if I just tell I don't even know how day. fresh air it was. It was very humid. For, for this time of year, it was very humid. I was working on the, well, I hope we have to use the fly and egg thing. Oh, yeah. Have you got any eggs here in the house? Yes, we do. Maybe we could boil a couple of them, because I need, I'm hard boiled. Okay. Because I need to see whether it's going to roll. There's a couple of it, uh, I had to change a little bit of it. You know how we got we used to get stuck at the corners once in a while? Yeah. We have to figure that out a little better. So I've, I've re redesigned it a little bit. 
Okay. But I was working way high with my hands stretched way up in the air trying to tie knots. And that, That's bad. I was having trouble with that. I had to stop and stretch. I, don't, I can't that. keep my, hand, my arms up for... Uh. I'll boil you a couple tonight for tomorrow. Yeah. You can uh, hard boil them. Okay. Because I just need to see how it's going to roll. Okay. Have all the Dog Fest visitors left now? I am considering Jerry as a resident, not a visitor. <laughs> yes, she is. I believe everyone has left. Nothing. Yes. We didn't have anybody we coming. We saying goodbye to a lot of people. Yesterday. I don't know. I don't think, I don't know that I saw anybody today, but that doesn't mean um, they weren't here. But most everybody, I think, left yesterday. And Sandy just left so much cooked so much food she just brings a carload of food she's our resident Italian cook yeah she just brings a ton of food um, and we ate it all um, we really did I don't think that, we I usually mean, do we, we, we ate it all um, you I, know what's in the salad I, I bought some Caesar salad now that yes that's good. still I up there for yeah. did you finish the lobster salad no someone they, did I don't know it's they not in there. in there no it's gone I, I, I just cleaned out the fridge and Tom took everything down. The only thing we have is ribs, potato. There was, uh, there was one lobster spaghetti thing last time I looked at but I, I, I tossed that. it. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of old. Um, was Violet and the baby out with the others? Yes. She did fine. I did, I did, the group is still split in half. I'm not too sure I have to do that now. But. Yeah. I think I could probably open both doors and just let it happen, whatever's going to happen. Um, Tina said she didn't get to say goodbye to too many. I was just thinking of her. I did not see her leaving. No, I had asked Sandy. I said, when is Tina leaving? And she said she already left. I said, oh, my goodness. I didn't even, she didn't, I didn't, I don't know that she, I don't know if I missed her saying goodbye or if she didn't make it. She did a great job of getting everything put together. Yeah. And if, um, you know, if you have an early flight, then. Yeah. Sandy does make good food. The meatballs and stuffed shells, and I don't even know what all she had. She kept coming in with trays. She really did. Okay. Anything else? Oh, dearest Carlene is refraining from sweets. A first. LOL. She's. No, I'm not refraining. I'm full. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind of big. That stuff that we had at Ben and Jerry's, it was. Butterscotch and things like that. It was very good. I didn't have any. I'm did, sugared up. Did she just give you a dish of it, or did, is, is it in the freezer? It's in the freezer. Oh. You put it. It fit here? in there. Yeah. Wow. I made it fit. Oh, good. It's sitting right. Oh, don't tell me. Okay. <laughs> I was hoping you'd take it. Well, it was either that, or you're going to have someone run up and down every time you want a bowl of ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> well, when you when I heard you saying, I feel like ice cream. Oh, you're here. You can go get me ice cream. I thought, is she sending her out to the store for ice cream? I forgot there was ice cream down in the in the thing. We got four bins of it. I we think. do. Four tubs? I didn't even know. I had chocolate, coffee, and the caramel. Is it like moose tracks or something, or what is the flavor? I don't even know. I didn't. It was I didn't. Good. I didn't have any ice cream. We had no cream. complaints on the ice cream. No. We don't complain on anything. No. Okay. Okay. Anybody else? I think we're going to... How do you solve a problem like Korea? Or did you see that? Yes, I have I have seen Sound of Music. No, no, oh, no. Is, it, is it your, your it's friend? Randy. Rainbow. <laughs> I, heard, I heard him. Was he on this morning? Yes, yeah, somebody sent it to me. And I played it for somebody. It wasn't me. I was. Uh, but that's where it comes from. Is the sound of music. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I think that we're going to say goodbye, and I think that's it. Yep. Yep. Okay. Good night, everybody. Thank okay. you.